Right, so we thought, uh, don't need to introduce myself, it's one of them silly vlogs again, isn't it? So, uh, something that we don't do with the bikes, we're going out on a KX500 today, but what we thought we would do is start filming the videos behind the videos, if you know what I mean, because they're quite funny. Some of the stuff that we talk about is actually quite funny. So I'm quickly packing my stuff. Whip It Will It is on his way, <clears throat> on his way to where all the bikes are. And I've got a meeting there and I'm actually running late because I'm still at home packing my, uh, my stuff. So I am literally going to turn the heating off because energy bills in this day and age and all that. So bosh, there it goes, that's off. And I am literally going to pack, well, I'm packing this now. It's a bit of a mess, look. And then I'm going to load the van up. And we're gonna go ride some dirt bikes, baby. Rose, what two bikes you got there then, Dave? We've got YZ 250. Nice. Been uh, giving it a bit of enduro spec. And we've got 2004 KX500, haven't we? Nice. You know, the big bad boys. The big bad boys. She's green and mean. Who, uh, <laughs> who tagged you in that picture on Facebook this morning? <laughs> I don't know what, oh, well, Andy Kelshaw. <laughs> oh, he loves it, doesn't he? I mean, you can't take that man seriously. They're just all after a bit of social credible, credibility, aren't they? That's what I thought. Yeah. I was gonna jump on it and say, look, don't start using because Dave just oh, gets all the footage on his phone. No, they don't. Oh no, listen, they, they, they want to play them games. I don't see him that much, to be fair. But he is quite funny because he normally wears a mankini, starts playing <laughs> all these gay shots and that lot, and there's a lot of him at the bar and that. He's got quite a nice bar at home. Has he? Yeah, yeah, yeah. But you know what it's like. No. They're old boys, aren't they? They've been taking pictures of bikes for a long time, and when they, you know, when they see something as sexy as me, yeah, they're gonna well, snap no. away, aren't they? This is it. Oh look out, he's got the tunes on. Right, do you reckon you're going to be able to find your way to this place? Well, I know how to get there main on the main road, obviously, but I'm going to do, we're going to do one like, of them shortcuts, is yeah, it? Yeah, I'm going to do one of them shortcuts I did with the boy the other week, with the boys, so I'm going to see if I can remember it going the other way. What are we doing here? Just so you can get around the track faster? Well, I, at the moment I've got a 250 and a 500. I'm going to be on the salads for a little while because I want to get the 125 out, give it a bit of ring dinging, do you know what I mean? Oh right, I see what you're saying, yeah, because of the suspension, yeah? And I feel a little bit tired today, for some strange reason, I don't know why. Fair but I'm going to, but isn't it funny that, because you're videoing, you've got camera out, you always feel like you need to, you know, you can't be miserable, you've got to show like. Well, I didn't think you was being miserable. You got where? Oh, oh you've gone a bit dark now, because we've gone in the trees. Well, there we go, I can see your face again. That's all alright, mate, because you know what it is like. Oh, there's a thing, I see you got the heating up. There's a little thing with Dave and my cousin that we was talking about. They love putting the heating up in the van and you've only got two, there's only two settings. They have um, Atlantic or melt your face off. So, well, this is up for debate really. People in their vans with the heater on and off. Can we at least look, can because, we at least change that? Yeah, but, yeah. that literally blasts on my face. Well, look, they can answer this, right? When you step into somebody's Matt Elsa's van, right? You abide by their rules. That's it. Don't you think it's rude when somebody else starts messing about with your dials and your radio and your bits and pieces? <laughs> it's, it's, a piss take, isn't it? it's a piss take. And then also as well, they wonder why they're hot because they're like got a hat on, t-shirt, jumper, gloves, oh, yeah, coat, my, what's it? And then they go, oh, it's bloody hot in here, isn't it? And yeah, you I, haven't even moved anywhere. I have got a puffer jacket on, I must admit. What, hang on, so what, what's happened? Well, I'm just thinking that I might have needed to have taken the right turn back there, but kind of winging it a little bit at a minute. <laughs> Could end up being a better route. We don't know that, do we? No. The law of averages will uh, decide, won't it? It is always the case, though, when you go through like, you know, alongside a big wood, you kind of think. It all looks the same. Well, no, I don't think that. I think I'd love to rip through there on the bike. That would make a lovely bit of enduro section. That would. Can we're in the wrong place? Do you? No, I reckon we're all right, personally. Do you? Yeah. Yeah. Even if we're not, I'm going to wing it, so it don't matter, does it? Alright. That's where I was meant to go this way. Fair enough. No, we definitely should have taken that turn. In. Yeah, I know where we are. It takes you to Shepherd's Well, doesn't it? Through it over there. Well, the sign says we're heading to Barham. 
Barham used to be an awesome track back in the day. Used to go there most Wednesdays. Well, a bit of track well, history with Willett yeah, as well. What, what, there. Used to ride there with the East Kent and Kent lot. It was their bollocks. <laughs> what was you riding back then? I was on an RM80 back then. RM80? Yeah, used to wait, get off of school. He was wait. the only nine year old with a beard apparently. <laughs> oh look, see look, that's the road shut, it's done me. Oh right, blame the council. There he is, look. How's it looking? Oh, you know, you know she's primo. <laughs> I've already heard you say prime, prime, prime. Is it like historical? Is um, it historical, yeah. The, um, that, that's unreal, isn't it? Let's have a look. What's unreal with your trainers? Or? Yeah, well, just a little bit of tack, isn't it? I'll tack. just check the Met Office and it looks like this is, well, it was supposed to be sunnier than this, to be fair. So we've had a sprinkle, we had a sprinkle of, uh, of water on the place. Welcome to the Willet Weather Report. Yeah, exactly. So now it'll be, it's going to be well good. It'll be good out there. I'm glad I bought, I mean, we've got the 500 in there, so we're, gonna, we're just going to give that a little test run and make her not such a track virgin. And then uh, I've got my, my 250 yam in there, uh, 15, on what I've been more converting to for the woods and that, just so I can first right back, just so I can get a little bit loose in that. So the grip's, yeah, this grip's going to be well appreciated. It's funny but, how things come round, isn't it? This is what yeah. I did my first video with you, Dave, and that was with a 500. Yeah, I know. You was pretty still like that with the camera then as well, weren't you? I was, I was, I I I weren't, I was running around like a wasp. But yeah, we've got, um, I reckon they're going to jump in. They, um, they got the little skid steer as well, so I reckon I'm going to jump in. And um, Mason's already been round there and tidied up the track quite a bit, and he's done an awesome job. I think he's only is he, 12 or 13, something like that. <laughs> and uh, yeah, it's mega what he's done, so I'm going to just give it a little bit of a give it a little bit of a tickle in a few areas with a bit of the mud and uh just to keep on top of things especially now because you can be a shit driver and just track it in and then that's pretty much what i'm going to do sweet as let's go are you uh just on youtube working out how to drive that just having a little look <laughs> you know let's look at it Buying piece of machinery. It's actually a cool little thing, isn't it? Yeah, these are well quick as well. It is. If you can drive one of these, it, 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 yeah, it's a bit of an art form. Mind you, are these built for sort of people? Because <laughs> I tell you, what, <laughs> I got built you. For people who can put the key in there. That'd be that'd be a start, wouldn't it? Yeah. Um, what was I going to say to you? I was going to say these, right? Like as I've said, I am no operator. I'm driving one of these. I'd like to give it the big end, but I can't. Right, so I'm going to look a little bit dumb, pressing a few buttons here. But the thing what impresses me with all of the, one of these, or what you relate to, when I first got into bikes, right, I used to watch in the winter Paris Bercy Supercross, and they used to drive around these, and they used to do a bit of a performance half to, like halfway through the show, and you'd watch them, and it just literally. Yeah, you'd be like, oh, that is cool. Yeah, so anybody that rides bikes normally always relates to like machines or diggers as well. Do you know what I mean? Because we just thought, we love the dirt, love the thing, don't you? And these, but these, there's some for me. There's something. Can't you roll them up and wheelie them and stuff yeah, like that? Yeah, I don't know, Bill. I'll <laughs> give it a go. Oh, it is Wednesday. Let's do a wheelie. Oh, I want to see you wheelie it. Let's see, even if look, let us know if you want to see him wheelie it. But yeah, so. Here we oh. go then. Oh. It looks like I know what I'm doing, but I haven't got a fucking clue. <laughs> you got a ticket for that? Sorry, it looks like I know what Come look at that. It's planting potatoes, I think. Well, you look like you knew what you're doing there a little bit. I think Alfie and Justin are pretty safe, though, don't you? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you, you won't be going to no uh, supercross in America, will we? Ah, uh, yeah, no, that'll do me though. I can then I can knock it into shape. You know, these, these track designers, they like to fanny about too much and make their work look pretty. <laughs> I don't mess about. And I'm all about the ride, do you know what I mean? <laughs> it's my excuse here that get out clause that was 
Oh, here we go, look. I don't think I'm on the stand right. Oh, yeah, no, you're a little bit twisted on there, mate. Oh, well. Yeah, for the record, <laughs> he literally kicked it three more times and it started. <laughs> oh, girl, she well, give a little spit out, didn't it? Yeah. It. And we knew there was fuel in there then. Yeah. Custy. Right. Hold up. Lovely times. It's nice. It's vibing. <laughs> Clint, we're vibing today. That is a nice looking bike. Well, I am not taking my coat off. You're not? Nah. Well, um, we've j I've just, um, this is on the vlog cam, not the uh, not the professional cam. There's a few problems with the KX, isn't there? Oh yeah, we've got to... We've got to have a little look at it in a minute. Yeah, go have a little look at it. Which is why we came out with it, wouldn't it? Cause yeah, yeah, just going to get out, get, yeah. Needs a little run, doesn't it? A little test run. Yeah. Well, I knew that there was a few little things. It's revving a little bit high for the start with. So if we get that sorted. The, old, um, the grips are moving already. As I was <laughs> kicking it over, I twisted them because... It's got you know some I mean? guns. Yeah, almost about, and it's beginning to rain now. I just want to get out and do a little bit of riding. Yeah, so I'm going to swap cameras because I've got to go professional mode now. <laughs> Oh, look at that. The sun's come out now. It's ruined my shot. Sun's out, guns out. Yeah, I don't know what's happening there. That's proper. Well, it's productive, Bill, wasn't it? Yeah, it was all right, wasn't it? Last it was priming the other track, so that was good. 
get out there and have a little blast up. It was good. Looking yeah. forward to uh, getting out a bit more. Obviously, Bill, what was your, uh, what do you reckon of the 500 then? We had a few problems there starting it. What, once once we got it started though, that was it. Yeah, but she was ticking along. Yeah, and you put it down, second kick, maximum starts up again, eh? No, it's not bad really, considering you ain't rode it for ages. Uh, I, I shit myself a little bit when you let me ride it back to the van. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but just then, how much of a rush did you get from that? Yeah, no, it's, it's like having a loaded gun between your legs. Excuse the pun. Eee. Eee. Right, get them in and we can go home. <laughs>